taken us to the Midlands. We're at Villa Park. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner, Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Aston Villa up against Arsenal. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Here's how the lineup looks for Aston Villa. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Luca Digne plays with Matty Cash in the fullback positions. Bubakar Kamara starts alongside Douglas Luis in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Can they convert? Couldn't grab hold of it. And so they start at 11 for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the main striker here is Edward Nketiah. It's looking promising. Spot on with that tackle. Well, he really is danger personified. But in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, at the moment, he's playing with great confidence. Every time he gets to the ball, he looks like scoring. Three goals in the last three games, and I'm expecting a similar performance again today. An Arsenal corner. And taken short. Can they nudge in front? Couldn't quite hang on. Managed to get it out of there. And he has options available, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Diaby. And Havertz. William Saliba. Now Zinchenko. Really committed himself to the tackle and a throw in now. Gabriel. And fine work from Arsenal to win it back. Making progress. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. And Kessia stopped a certain goal. It will be Arsenal's corner as they try to nudge in front in this game. Can someone get on the end of this? It might still be problematic. Martin Odegaard. Well, possibilities inside the box. Shaping to shoot. Oh, he's blocked it! Now counter-attacking possibilities. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Well, there we have it. That's going to be all for the first half here in the Midlands. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. 